Hi, I'm Josh, and this... This is a Ukrainian lens I'm putting on my Micro Four Thirds. Specifically, it is an Indostar 61 55mm f2.8 lens that I found used on eBay for about $25 USD, including the international shipping. Something to know right away about this lens is it doesn't use a modern mount type. It uses a M39 screw thread mount, so you'll need an adapter plate for your camera. Like uh, my Micro Four Thirds uses this Photosy L39, the Micro Four Thirds adapter, and it just mounts on normally to your camera, and then the screw threads adapt right here. Now it's ready to go on your camera. That mount adapter cost me less than $10 on Amazon. I tested this lens for video around the old market district of Omaha and was pretty impressed. The image quality is surprisingly crisp, but still soft enough for that cinematic nostalgic feel, which is exactly what I wanted. These test shots happen on an unexpectedly cloudy morning, so I cannot confidently attest to the color saturation or vibrancy. Be aware that I did make color adjustments to these shots in Premiere Pro. There are limitations with this lens that you need to be aware of before using. It is completely manual, so focus and aperture are controlled by hand on the lens, not through camera settings. The focus ring does operate smoothly, but the aperture ring clicks on each f-stop, so changing depth of field while recording video is not recommended. This also means no built-in image stabilization. I have a Panasonic Lumix G7 which relies on lenses for image stabilization, so my handheld shots came out shaky. The Indostar 61 being a 55mm lens made this even more apparent. However, when using a monopod, the shots came out just fine. Gimbals and video software adjustment tools like Warp Stabilizer and Premiere Pro can also help alleviate this problem. None of these limitations have dissuaded me from using this lens though. Its small size makes it easy to carry along, the image quality exceeds the expectations I have for a $25 lens, and I think it just looks cool on my Lumix G7. These barn shots are not Omaha by the way. I just wanted to test this lens on my camera in low lighting situations without the help of a monopod or tripod. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Maybe I'll encourage you to get a little M39 lens for your camera bag. I know this Indostar 61 is staying in my camera bag. I'm going to look at other M39 lenses to add to it as well. So if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more like it, please like it. Leave me comments below and I'll definitely do more like it. So thanks again for watching. See you next time.